This is such an obvious one. And it's always... It is always what it is, though, isn't it? It's always, it's always the obvious shit that you never think is worth mentioning because it's obvious. And then for some reason, no one ever thinks about it or does it. Um, you know, act, act the way that makes you feel good. Because I think, I don't know, a lot of people do things that they should do. And that, you know, you kind of want to do because you should do them. So it's supposed to get you where you want to be. So by nature, you want to kind of do it. But really, it's not the stuff that like, you know, like you dress a certain way because people want you to dress that way. Or you talk a certain way because people want you to talk that way. Or you do certain activities because it's it's largely regarded as impressive. But if these things don't make you tick and there's not something about the thing that you're doing that makes you want to do it more regardless of if you were the only person in the world or not, then I think that's like, you know, that's fucked up. And we should all really like, obviously there's going to be things that you don't want to do somewhere down the line and you're going to have to do them to get to where you want to be. But by and large, we should all be obsessed with the thing that we really want to do. And be truthful to yourself and don't lie to yourself because it's easy to lie to yourself to make things easier. Because a lot of us growing up are told that, you know, you can do whatever you want or you can be whoever you want to be. And then when you get to like the age that we're at now, like 19, 20, 21, even your early 20, even probably your late 20s, to be honest, you kind of, that light dims out a little bit and you probably start to think, oh, maybe I can't do everything that I want to do or maybe I can't be whatever I want to be. And it seems like, that's not attainable and that's not possible. And then I think maybe, maybe or maybe not at, a, at another point, you kind of realize that it is all possible. It's just whether or not you're willing to work hard enough for it or whether or not you're willing to give up what you're supposed to, or what you're going to have to give up for it. And so you kind of cop yourself out by saying it's impossible or by not believing in yourself. And by nature, believing in yourself is scary because now you're holding yourself accountable to do something. Versus if you just give up, you give up. So you don't really need to hold yourself accountable. So that's what it is. I've come to my own conclusion over the course of the past two minutes and 34 seconds. Um, you need to do what you want to do and you need to dream big and you need to not give a fuck about the fact that you are probably going to fail and actually probably accept the fact that you're gonna fail and just do it anyways. I don't even know what to title this. What the fuck am I gonna call this? This has been the least organized one so far and I've been pretty organized with these. What are you going to call it? I don't know. Figure it out.